No. These days it's nothing more than antique shit. But these things were whack. Oh, 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 for the first time in 1904, human beings enjoy themselves. human house. Music was not available to those antique knobs. The first recording ever made was of these nuts. <laughs> That was Atos the Flo Nighting Florence Gale describing the balaclava followed, so did many other shitty recordings of shitty music and shitty poetry. Tennyson, reading selections from Mom It was very, very popular popular But human beings were eventually replaced by flat recordings. This is Edison's disc of 18 inches. Fragile, heavy, and very, 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 very thick. Thick as Edison's dick. This is the Edison horn player, obvious where it got its name. The size is taken mechanically down here and then travels a up the tube tube and out of the horse. Sometimes these ones came with boobs. By the 1920s, this was the height of heavy metal. Wow. By the 50s, you'd rent a course after every single record. By the 90s, this was the height shed when the gramogram and the radio phone shared a cabinet, making the radio radio. Lol. But isn't the summer? And what you've just been listening to is the ultimate in recorded sound. And what you've just been listening to is system of a down. It will make you obsolete. It's dud susp proof, scratch proof, digitally digitally ordered, red by red laser, and it's called biggest cusp. And it pumps you digitally or, 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 or and this is the lazy factor that does no work. More magnified 112 looks like this. You can see the thousands of tits and groovy lasers. When it's lasered or playbacked off by another red laser in the monitor play laser machine, the level of the groove and the disc between them give varying light, which then die. And and I am a fucking cock. That information is read by a laser from my manhandle. It is also surprisingly small. And off you go. Introducing two.